Hi friends, welcome to Testing Tutorials Point. This is Lokesh and today we are going to discussing about how to create a workflow file in a GitHub Actions. Okay, for GitHub Actions creation, we need to follow another format. One second, is a file it is heavy. Okay, here what we need to create, right? One file we need to create that is the action file this is the file we need to create this file what would ha happen right uh, basically uh, we need to run for our entire code into a git repo to cloud that is a browser stack or if you want a local run everything you can able to do it by using this particular ml file okay this is basically cac process whenever you check out and check in and it will run for you every time in a backend okay for this we need to create for this particular uh, file action just i'm going to creating a root directory and creating a file with the dot extension and after that i'm going to copying this location file i'm pasting here okay if you go to the top what will happen the first position of it is a name it is showing that uh, cad process ci process and there is a on push pull request time if you want only push you can able to keep it for push and remove for pull request okay and what is the job it is taking for any latest push or pull request is coming just make it for checkout time you can run into this build actions okay and for this we need to node version we need to 18 we need to install and name the package like uh, npm install and run and if you here is a test and this is a local runner we need to change the local runner and this all the actions are presented okay and meanwhile we need to like in the last video session time we create for secret password right for that secret password we need to keep it here okay run configuration first i will change it this is the run configuration file copy and i'll keep it because i am going to run for a single file to connecting for that particular one and then enter nvr env and enter and then provide for username and password which is the bs code time we provided for this particular username right for that username and this keyword and here i am not going to run now okay just i am going to do it for configuration okay now here what i can do right now i'm going to github this is the username for this username i'm just i'm going to configure okay and how we can able to configure we need to access for github secret key for this we need to use for dollar to curly braces and provide the value before value we need to use for this is the secret keys right you need to copy the secret keys okay and paste it before that and dot that will access for secret keys okay the same thing you need to copy here as well and you need to paste it here and for this you need to copy for key value okay this is our file okay and this is our configuration file and we are going to once we committed automatically that actions can able to this action section is there right this action section will automatically trigger for backend okay if everything is good perfectly if there is no issue then it will work otherwise it will fail okay we'll see in the next video session time how it will execute once it is committed okay thank you for watching please do subscribe and share to your friends and colleagues thank you